Hi, welcome to Verdi Training Video Program. In this session, I will introduce the debug solution for people who are running AMS course simulation. In this video, I will go through the following topic. The first one is what's the merge FSDB and how to dump it building AMS course simulation. Second, how the Verdi AMS display with your design. Third, how to debug interface element or through net. The last one is the, how to debug your current on the connection. As you know, Verdi is the debug platform mainly rely on two databases, KDB and FSDB. One contains your design information, the other records the simulation results. To debug AMS core simulation, Verdi extends the support language from Digital HDO to Spice Eldo and Verge. So you can see all analog design and the digital design in one Verdi environment. In addition, with VCS AMS core simulation, user is able to dump a single FSDB which contains digital and analog signals. With unified KDB and FSDB, all debug features in Verdi for digital design now works for AMS too. As I mentioned, you don't have to deal with multiple FSDB files now which may have different hierarchy of time scale. In this merge FSDB, you can see a single hierarchy tree, different icon for analog and digital. And you can pick up the analog signal or digital signal to the waveform now. Before running call simulation with VCS AMS, please remember add the switch dash KTV in the VCS command line. The database we automatically generated for Verdi along with SIMV. Here are the snapshots of Verdi AMS. You can see the unified hierarchy tree, different scope with different design, and even a, a single schematic view with analog power and digital. The first step to debug cost simulation usually starts from the interface element. Verdi AMS will read the report from VCS AMS to display the location of the interface element on the design hierarchy tree. You can double click to see the detail of the report or simply drag and drop to waveform to see both side signal. Or you can debug from your schematic view. Verdi has multiple tracing feature and all of them now work in AMS design. Here is an example of tracing connectivity from an interface element. You can see the tracing result on the message window and the schematic view. If you prop the current value in FSDB, then show focus connection feature can annotate the, the value of your current so you can verify the flow of your current. Okay, now let's see how Verdi AMS work. On the left hand side, the design hierarchy tree showed in this case we have digital top and the sub are analog. And we also have the interface element information and through name. So from the source code, you can see the annotation for D2A or A2D. On the tree, you can see the how many interface element under this scope. If you like to debug, drag and drop to waveform. Verdi will add the analog waveform and the digital waveform at the same time. You can also do the trace for the connectivity and show on schematic. You can see different color for digital and analog and also the connection from digital to analog. You can also annotate the value for FSDB, change the time, you can see the value change. Or you like to see table view, you can select one segment, right mouse button, to see the detailed information of this segment. Some people may like to open wave view to do the analog wave view debug. We really also provide integration with WaveView. So just right mouse button, add a signal to WaveView. 
So the wavy will open and press node. The time will align with the verdi. Okay, that's a that's a quick demo for verdi AMS. Thank you for watching. Okay, in this video, what we learn it's the merge FSDB and how it work, and how to use the option DHKDB to generate database for Verdi, and the overview of Verdi AMS GUI, and how to debug your interface element with the waveform or the schematic view, and also how to use the table view to see the current and the voltage value. In the end, we talk about the integration with WaveView. So some users, they can continue use WaveView with the same FSDB and the same signal. Thanks again for watching it. Hope it's helpful to you. If you have any question, feel free to contact your local support team of Synapsis. We're happy to have you with any question.